What's going on YouTube? This is Nicky Boy and today I'm going to show you an, another air quote video tutorial. Now today's tutorial is generally around video and audio, you know, kind of matching it up. Now if you're like me, I like to have music in the background of my videos and as I'm sure you do as well, which is why I'm doing this tutorial. Anyway, moving on. So, as you can see, the actual footage is from a website. I can't remember what website it's called, actually. I just Googled it. Um, what did I Google now? Free stock video footage, I think. Not sure. Anyway, so yeah, as you can see, it's 1 minute 41 long, and the actual song itself is 7 minutes 2. And when you add it, yeah. Did you click that? There. So what happens is it continues to play. And it's a black screen. So there is an easy way of doing it, obviously. So let's just undo that and let's just add that. No, undo that. Sorry, and then add that. Even though I'll just do the same. Anyway, let's drag all this away to the bottom. That's the much easier way I can just split it. But anyway, moving on. So, as you can see, it just stops there. But again, there's more music to be added to. You got, basically, you want the whole full track, don't you? So, like I said, I found a way of getting around that to edit the audio that matches your video clip size length obviously so what you want to do is get rid of that for first so undo that undo that uh, undo that because I don't need that and you want to go to adobe.com and download the audition to um, I always said tutorial then trial it's free trial so let's get on with it so what you want to do is is you want to go to import file and then, yes, sorry, I meant to mention where I got this song from. And uh, it's from No Copyright Sounds. They're on YouTube, fantastic YouTube channel. I recommend you go and have a look because they've got some quality music and it's free. So, anyway, so let's just add that into it. And as you can see here, there's a waveform for that song. Then what you want to do is you want to go to multi-track and let's just call this, you know, tut. Leave all the rest of it like that and just press OK. Now what you want to do is you want to grab that and slot it into there. And that's your track. So what you want to do now is you want to go to remix and then enable remix. So as you can see here, this is the length of the track. Now our video is 1 minute 41. You want to go back to there. So what I want to do is I want to take 5 away. So that will be 36 there. And it's going to be 1. 1 minute 36. I'm going to put this to 0, 0. So it's 1 minute 36 long. There you have it. Done. Simple as that. Easy. So then you want to go to export. Most track mix down entire session. Uh, keep top mix down. Let's just keep it as that. Leave everything there as it is. Save it, and they have it. Go back to iMovie or your video editor. Import it, and this is the track. Isn't it? Yep, it is. And um, you want to add that. That's it. It's like literally done. So no editing, no cropping or fading and stuff, you know, fading away, it goes fading. Majority of us all do, but I mean, I think this is an easy and quicker way of adding audio to your videos to, you know, the length of your video footage. So anyway, I hope it's been useful and helpful to you a lot and Please give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Leave a comment of how you've done in your videos. 
and uh, any suggestions or tips that you want to share with anybody else then like i said feel free to comment and uh, share with the world if you're not already subscribed please hit that subscribe button thanks for watching and as always take care